So I get to speak from two perspectives, the artists and local government. <laughs> well, I'm hoping um, that organizations could take a page out of the book um, for the Artists at Work program. One of the things that I really respected was that they connected to regional, then they connected to a local organization in my community who connected to me. Yes. And that ensures that I had a seat at the table and all of the decision making and, and with the local organization that I was already familiar with and the requirements they had that I do work, which I was already doing, do work in, in my community, but also that the regional organization, uh, Delta Commons, also connected to Lee Street Community Center, partnered together to make sure that I had support. First, they made sure I had a salary and health insurance and that I had support that um, you know, when the stress of the work and then the heaviness of um, the storytelling I was doing uh, you know, around being a descendant and being the founder of Descendants of the Elaine Massacre and doing the work of telling my ancestors' stories and first learning about them and then telling those stories and uh, working with other artists in the community that um, you know, it was so impactful. And when I say trickle down, mm -hmm. I was able to, with the support of artists at work, to, you know, just answer questions I didn't even, you know, know I had, you know. So I'm hoping there could be more programs like that. I love the continuation of the artists at work. Um, during that year of, and this was in 22, I found information about the Elaine Massacre I didn't even know existed. You know, um, stories a soldier had written about what he witnessed happened to the sh black sharecroppers during the massacre. And I was able to connect to young people and help them, you know, understand their history and they became a part of this process with me. So it was truly reg national, regional, and then local on the ground work and making sure I'm at the table, I'm part of the process, and then they're making sure they are funding someone who's connected to that community, that right there on the ground connected to that community. So, and making sure artists have that support that they need financially um, and just someone calling and just checking in on me. And then they, it was so much involved in it that year with artists at work, uh, personal development classes, grant writing, how, I mean, just a class every month in supporting me. So I think a lot of that, you know, that support for artists is just imperative. And so I would hope um, everyone would take a page out of Artists at Work project. Great, thank you so much. And 